James Catherine Neal, Philippa Johnston, Moira Stewart, Caroline John, Van Mitchell, Jenny Gudgeon, Karen Ross, Ian Ledwood, Zoe Dobsher, Aileen Clark, Kirsty Lorenz, Diane King, I'm um, Clara Neal, Jim Brown, Derek Robertson, Miss Rowley, Paul Bartlett, I'm a Metal Smith, working a process called Naked Raku, a jeweler silversmith, Van Rika, a photographic artist, I do ceramics, all multimedia, fine graphics, mixed media artist, fibre art and textile art, flower painter, I make jewellery, woodworker, I paint wildlife and landscapes, I make stained glass windows, mainly wildlife um, art. You know, Open Studios is about welcoming people in, um, showing some of your materials, some of your processes. It's a chance to see somebody's working space and at the same time see the work or at least some of the work that they make in that space. I'm showing people what I do and then they look at how long it's taken me to do three lines and to uh, the, the whole pictures and it's like, oh, you know. For Fife, it's, it's, probably, it's, it's the most significant um, art event, I think, of the, uh, of, of the calendar. You can't, you can't beat something like the Open Studios for, for meeting your buying public. It's a great opportunity because people come from all over the country to, to see this. People want the stories behind the work, they want to know the artist. I think there's something, if, if they've spent a bit of money on an art piece and they've got their friends around, they want to say, oh yeah, I met the artist and she lives there and she does this. For me, Open Studios is the highlight of the year, even though I show through galleries, I don't do craft fairs and things, um, because it's the one time when I can really talk to the public about my work. I can see people trying things on and I love to see that. I think that's great fun. That's more important to me than, than selling the work, actually. It's just lovely to chat to people and just to explain what I do. So some people will literally just want to pop in, have a look and go. Some people aren't, re aren't here to buy, they just want to have a good old look around the studio and find out what you do. Some people are aspiring artists or designers and they want a little bit of a point in the direction of how you how you got started and um, there's, everyone wants something different. As opposed to, I suppose, an exhibition where I'm just hanging paintings on the wall and people have to ask me how I did it here, they actually get to see you know, how I'm doing it. The more you know about the painting, whether it's the story behind it or the person who painted it or how it was done, I think the, the, more, the more interested you are in the picture. The great thing about uh, the Open Studios North Fife is that it is real working spaces. So you can see how the artist is working and you can see the, the materials they use, the techniques, the way they kind of plan the things and put things together. So it's a real engagement with the artist and the way that they work. It's, it's just really fun going around and just seeing everyone's work. Come and see the diversity. It's a, it's a great part of Scotland to come and explore anyway. And there's such a variety of different types and styles. You can, you can dip in and out as much as you want really. You can just, some people just have one or two venues that they want to go and see and others are trying to do everything over the three days. So, so um, it's, it, it's also a good opportunity to explore parts of Fife that you wouldn't usually get to. Oh, you could just come and have have a look, uh, just come to one event, one venue, see what it's like. One of the things I hear again and again from visitors is, is that it's a, a great way of exploring the countryside. So you get a unique view of really quite out of the way places um, and uh, get to see into people's homes. I mean, who wouldn't want to see that? A couple from Dundee came for the first time last year and the chap asked me an interesting question. He said, is Fife particularly rich in artists? because there are just so many in this small area. And I thought, yes, that's a very good question. And it does seem to be. Come, <laughs> just come and see what we're doing, you know, come and have a nosy. Don't waver, get off the fence and come around because, uh, you know, nowhere else in the country are they going to see as many artists work and meet the artists at the same time.